Hi everybody, I thought I'd do a little bit something different today. I have a couple clocks here. One I made my mom and one fell down and broke. And she wants me to interchange the hands because the one that I made her has like a gold, gold hands on it and she can't see it very good. So she wanted me to interchange the hands on the clock. So come along with me while I do this little clock exchange hands craft. Okay, so here's the old clock. And you can see um, the new one that I made her has these little gold, but that's what came with the clock. So that's the clock mechanism. And here's the old ones and you can clearly see these better. So I'm going to take these off. Oops, that one came off with it. I already took those off, but just for time's sake, I wanted to show you what I'm going to do here. Sorry about that bumping. So I'm, I was going to exchange the whole kit and caboodle, but you know what? I'm like, I don't have to do that. Hopefully these will be the same size, just exchanging the hands so she can see these black ones a little bit better. And I don't blame her. So hopefully these work. That seems to be working. These are just really, really thin metal. I don't know if any of you have worked with these clocks, but... I'm going to preset this to... Three o'clock. It might be. Oh, I think it's a little after three. So, get some batteries and see if this works. One battery? Okay. She wanted something with apples on it because she has her house, her kitchen decorated with apples. So I made her an apple clock. Hey, it works. Now I'm going to check the time. She, she has this um, up in her kitchen and she said, every time she sees me, she said, I miss my clock in my kitchen. So, um, I saw her yesterday and she didn't say it. So... I thought today I had a little extra time. It's Sunday here and I'm like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fix that clock for her. So gosh, what'd that take? All of two minutes. So, um, yeah, just checking the time here. Okay, it's 320. Uh oh. We'll set this up to 320. Maybe. hands are very, I don't even think they're aluminum. I bought it there. I think that'll work. 
she'll be happy I got that done. making this for that was kind of tricky. Oops, wrong way. Uh -oh. strip it. Just tighten up on that one. Yeah, let's strip. When I get it tightened again, I'm going to leave it. There we go. Alright, put the battery back in. that works for. Alright gang, that's my little clock project. I think I'm going to take the clock mechanism out of this one. Yep, that's what I'm going to do. And Keep that for uh, another project if I can. Oh, oh, it's just stuck. Oh, that's what I need for that one. Oh, that's an idea, but all the stick is off. So, I've got an idea. I kind of think that would look nicer there. I kind of scraped that. I put that on there. Put the head on that other one. I think I might do that. Yeah, indecisions, indecisions. This is easy enough though. Like I said, these come off fairly easy. to get it on there good and I sure did. Alright, now let's let's make this
that would be perfect for that. If you hear something go crash, boom, bang, that would be my craft lunch. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go for now. I hope you enjoyed this video. You can see that I got it fixed. So uh, I'm just gonna go in and kind of tweak it a little bit, see if I can find that soft um, packing. I know if you guys saw, you know what everybody talked about, really thin. And I can put a piece of that and I can even maybe glue this so this it you know it was wobbling around so I will see you guys in my next video bye God bless and don't forget to smile because I love you but more importantly our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ loves you the most and that's the best love you can have all right everybody I'll see you in my next video bye